Oh! Oh, my stage! <laughs> Look, man, I'm uploading the vlog right now, bro. Hey, McQueen! What's up, man? You supposed to be over here two hours ago. Don't make me expose, nigga. I'm pretty sure all black people can relate, man. Look, we, sometimes we say we're gonna be, Why is you FaceTiming me? Oh, my bad. <laughs> Look at this nigga. If you ever on McQueen time. Man, shut up. This nigga nickname is Mega Big Bullshit. <laughs> See, you don't want to want to ever mention the times where you be bullshitting. You just want to talk about when I be bullshitting. But this nigga don't tell you what happens behind the scenes. Remember uh, a couple days ago? You know, the other day, I called your ass. I said, hey, man, we're going to film some Instagram skits. And you was like, oh, yeah, you know what I'm saying? We're going to do it tomorrow. Woo, woo. And then I wake up, right? I edit my vlog. Everything's all good. I take my showers all straight. I went over to Nate's house, filmed a video with that nigga, called your ass like three times. You ain't answer. And then I come back to the house. I'm there for three hours trying to text you. And then you call me back talking about, oh, what's up, bro? What you trying to do? Acting like nothing happened. I don't remember that. Yeah, you don't remember that. You be on that bullshit said, too. I remember you said that, but I don't know. Yeah, what you, happened. Yeah, you was on bullshit. That's what happened, nigga. No, but you don't ever want to include that. No. Niggas just want to talk about me. Niggas just want to talk about me in here. The reason I couldn't make it is because you, I was fucking young, dude. I'm talking to your ass watching right now. <laughs> hey. I mean, you poke that nigga in the nose, bro. Yeah, don't make me expose you, nigga. Did I do that? But me on the other hand. Still ugly. Uh, 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 Come on, Nate. 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 Come Come to me. <laughs> Don't fall. I got it. Okay, move forward. Really fast. Go. Why are you trying to get me to bust my ass? <laughs> now turn around. Stop. <laughs> Yeah, you're good. Now turn around again. Oh, look who it is. Oh, I think I got it. I did it. Hi. Hey, girl. Hi. 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 I'm just going to keep recording just in case you do brush your eyes, you know? Are you scared? No. I'm cautious, though. <laughs> to see if you will go back. <laughs> what is going to be fun? Did he do that in the movie? Huh? Did he use a balloon as a condom? In the movie? Has anybody ever done that ever? I wonder. I don't think so. All my pants are dead. As a tat! About to go to the damn uh, course right now. You know what I'm saying? Shoot some hopes. Please, please. Say that again. Please, I don't know what's gonna happen after that. Um, you know what I'm saying? We're just gonna the day is just getting started, man. So I'm just gonna see and go with the flow. 
see what happens, man. We're going to shoot some more Instagram skits today. We're going to shoot some more Instagram skits today? I got to do one more scene. I got to do a couple more scenes for my music video. Okay, that's what we're going to do today. Friday almost coming up, y'all. Y'all know how we get on the weekend. Y'all know how we get. But for now, it's cleanse week. It's still cleanse week. You know what I'm saying? We cleansing the hell out of ourselves. I ain't, we've been surviving on water and workouts. Yeah, man, we're going to see y'all at the court or wherever the hell we end up. All right? You know when you walking, bro, you walking down the street and niggas act like they can't just go around you and they just try to shoulder check you? Like, nigga, I'm about to shoulder check every bitch that don't know how to fucking walk from this point. Yeah. Every single one of them. Yeah. I'm about to just yeah. get your ass out the fucking way, man. Yeah. LA Fitness, get your shit together, man. Kick this off for being black. You know what I'm saying? So we gonna go to UCLA and hoop and stay. Hey, man, for all you niggas that, that don't really know me, know me, know me, know me, and wasn't with me from the beginning of my, my main channel. I'm gonna keep it 1,000 with y'all right now. Now this might kick you in the nuts when I tell you this shit. But I, I just, you know what I'm saying, I gotta keep it 1,000. We at UCLA right now, right? I'm driving around and I'm seeing all these students talking about, oh, I'm going to the student store. I'm talking about, oh, I gotta study for this test. You know what I'm saying? All this bullshit. All these niggas that attend. No, I don't, bro. Little that nigga right there, yeah. back there that said you got a lighter. Right. That nigga gonna be broke as Right. Hell. Little, do all these niggas know? They thinking that they gonna get a good job, graduate, and get a good job and live a great life. But the sad fact is, all these niggas gonna be broke. Ain't that right? Yeah. It's true, guys. Unless you know what you want to do. Unless you, if you one of them niggas that just go to college because you think it's the only way out. You're wasting your money, nigga. You wasting your money and you guess graduate how much, guess how much money y'all 16 of them things nigga 16 of them things you know what that things mean that means thousands nigga Damn. 16 bands nigga you think that you're gonna uh, get that piece of paper to say oh you know what i'm saying we'll, we'll graduate it and then you know what i'm saying you think niggas gonna give you that recommendation everything's gonna be all good woo, woo, woo. you know what i'm saying when really all it is is just a piece of paper and then after you graduate after that ceremony over Oh yeah, two months later they're gonna be knocking at your door. Where my sixty thousand dollars at? No, that's six months. But if you get a job, they're gonna hit you up ASAP. Nigga. Yeah. If you get a job, they're gonna hit you up ASAP, nigga. I need that. And you're gonna be like, well, I ain't got a job yet. Well that's too damn bad, nigga. You better you better find that damn money. You know what I'm saying? Give me your car, nigga. Give me your car. You know what, bitch? Give me your house. Right. So all I'm saying is, man, I'm not telling you if you wanna go to college. Then don't go to college i'm saying if you want to go to college because you know that that is where your dream is then do it but if you wanted niggas like oh no i gotta go to college because i think it's the only way out i don't know if i want to do what i really want to do because you know it's too scary you went for a rude awakening man just a little fun fact for y'all take it for someone who graduated from college man i graduated you know what I'm saying? And I owed $60,000. Thank God my school got shut down. You know what I'm saying? And I ain't had to pay that shit back. But I owed $60,000. So think. Think, bro. Think before you do that shit. Think before you sign papers. Go get your money. Do what you really want to do. All right, I'm done being motivational now. All right, man, me and this nigga DD's about to get this uh, the three-point contest going. You think you finna win? Yeah, I'm finna blow your ass up. No, I'm You ain't finna blow me. It's okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> he ain't not about to blow me out. You might win. We're going to see who win, bro. I don't know. Honestly, and usually I'm confident who going to win. I don't know, bro. But we're going to see. All right, man. So me and DDG just did a three-point contest. I won the first one. This nigga won the second one. We better run this 1v1.
That was for the coach. Five seven. Yeah. Let me catch my breath first. All right, DG won the first one. Hey man, we just got done hooping. I'm tired as hell. Uh, you already know where we at again, man. It's Farmer Boys back at the spot. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna get this sandwich again. That's what it look like. Well, from the smack on this wall. About his bread and take your biscuit off my dick. She just trying to give me head. A, a bunch of young niggas sit where they like 40. You want some Wendy's? Yes, Wendy's is so good. Well, that's too damn bad. You can't have not. Ah, 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 ah. What'd you say? In and out is trash. Blasphemy. Don't ever tell me some blasphemous stuff like that it again. It tastes like cardboard. Look, man, if y'all niggas from Cali, y'all know the In and Out schmack. Well, if All you're right. from the South, uh, you well, know, when they ain't nobody, ain't nobody out. You nigga. know, Whataburger is killing In and Out. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Why is it not talked about like In and Out then? Yes, it is. It's not. It's just the southern thing. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Niggas know about In and Out. Okay. Niggas hear about it from from New York. Who so, talking about Who talking about Whataburger in New York? A lot of people. Nope. How you know? Because how you know that they because not I was, talking about because it. I went to New York as soon as I got the plane. Some niggas was over there with Tim's on talking about A O B. You know what I'm saying? I heard on the West Coast that I in not smack B. Facts. What I say? What'd you say? That In and Out is trash. And therefore, In and Out is trash. Look, you are one. You are one. One. One opinion. One. A lot of people think so. Who? Ashley thinks so too. Man, Ashley on that bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> it's not good. I'm gonna just be real. It's really not. Okay. It tastes like cardboard. No, it don't. It's like no flavor at all. Man, In and Out is juicy and fire. Nigga, you are pulling up to Wendy's. Okay. Wendy's is better than you, In and Out. You are going to Wendy's right now talking about In and Out not good. What is wrong with you? <laughs> what? What do I want? I want a baconator with no cheese. You want a baconator with no cheese? Yeah, I don't like cheese. <laughs> I'm a very picker, picker. See, that's why you don't like in and out. Yeah, I, I think that's probably why. But yeah. it's still like even there's no flavor. Bro, we're not no. having this discussion. It's, it's already trash. over with. Wait, there's no is no there is no discussion. You you tripping, that's all it is to do it. Hello? Hi. Hi. Can uh, you hear me? Order? Can I have a number four with no cheese? Number four? Yes. No Call cheese. Can it, can we get no cheese on the number four, please? Sure. And the small, medium, or large? Medium. Medium, and what drink? Um, lemonade. All right, let's get out. That's it. Wait, what What other sauce does come? <laughs> what other sauce comes on that? So number four, I had mayo, ketchup. Oh, no, no mayo, please. Okay. Thank you. Would I be all? Yes. 10 20, thank you. Okay, okay. Baby, it's yours. I'm yours. If you want it tonight, I'll give you the red and light special. I look good in this red light, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Tell me why I knew you was gonna say some shit like that. I don't know. Red light special. I'm looking very special in this red light. Are you? Mm-hmm. See, I could just put this as a thumbnail. Niggas will click on it.
Can you just make it plain? Just make it plain. Hi. Yeah. Oh, hi. I get rich. There you go. Get that. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Wait. Yeah. Tell them to make it plain. Like with bacon and meat. What are you saying? Just bacon and meat. Bacon and, and meat. And yeah, ketchup. And yeah. What is wrong with you? <laughs> I don't like cheese. Nigga, we told him we wouldn't no cheese. Yeah, but he said something else is on it. I said no mayo too. I just want to make sure because I excuse me, really excuse me, sir. Uh, what exactly is on the burger Can besides? Just, the, uh, what? Wait, never mind. It's okay. Oh, I can't stand your way. <laughs> never, never mind, bro. We cool. Appreciate it. Can I get some ketchup? Yeah, we're not. We're not. Oh, this shit smells good. What? You gonna make fun of me? Can I get ketchup? Can we? Yeah, can we get ketchup, please? Man, you ruining this nigga day. Oh, shit. This is job. Appreciate Thank it, bro. Thank you. Have a good night. Thank you, man. Mm. Welcome back. Yeah. <laughs> you an asshole, nigga. Have you ever worked a customer service job? See, that's why you're such an asshole. I'm not an asshole. Yep. It's his job. Mm -hmm. To give me ketchup? Mm -hmm. How is that an asshole? Mm -hmm. I'm not talking about all that. I'm talking what? about, oh, uh, your indecisive ass at the window. Oh, well, you just gotta learn how to work with people. Like Man, that. shut up. You shut up. You guys want to say? I know you do. I'm gonna eat this burger. I know you will eat that burger. <laughs> I'm so hungry. How hungry are you? I haven't eaten all day. Mm. Interesting. Jelly Rancher in, make it sweeter. Versace my clothes, I wear a white hoe, and she snorting three lines like Adidas. Got a black girl rolling off Molly. Got a white bitch snoring off snow. Said she want real niggas in the party. Parents gonna leave the keys.